Mommy? I'm sorry, Mommy. <laughs> anyway, hello, everybody. I'm Average Joe Squad. And I'm Zongetsu 134. And as always, this is Remember the Hyphen. Well, yeah. But this is more... This yeah, is more this trailer is react. Trailer right? react. So, uh, She-Hulk trailer drop today. Or well, new, rather new, yesterday. New actual trailer. We, yeah. had it, we had a teaser before, but an actual trailer dropped. Yeah. And uh, it looks good. Yeah, it does look really good. Um, so... Basically, for those of you who don't know, She-Hulk, She-Hulk is better known as Jennifer Walters, is the cousin of Bruce Banner, better known as the Incredible Hulk, and due to an accident or something, she needs a blood transplant, and the only person with the same blood type as her was Bruce. Unfortunately, his blood is irradiated with gamma radiation, thus whenever she is angry or, fe or afraid, she turns into the Incredible She-Hulk. Savage She-Hulk. Savage She-Hulk. Well, or Sensational. There's sensational. a couple of adjectives. But, um... And so basically that, like, more or less that's her story. As she's a, a lawyer who fights crime and also, uh... As, in, as this show shows, she's working with a new branch of the legal system that deals with superhero crime. Or at least that's what it looked like from the trailer for me. Charlie Cox, Daredevil? I... Where? I don't know. I, people act like he's going to be working for them. I'm like, I don't know. I I hope that's I feel not like the case. like he's going to be the opposition. Yeah, I, I'd rather him be like a, a a regular lawyer, like he is, like with Nelson and Murdoch, if they're going to do. Listen, the most the, the most happy and exciting rumor of all for this <clears throat> was confirmed true, and that is uh the hero we all deserve, Frogman, is in the trailer. God fucking damn! <laughs> I look, I have nothing really against Frogman, but oh my god. I, we're gonna send him to space. Oh my god, that, that that was awful. I don't know who fucking approved that, but but no. In all honesty, um, probably the rumor because there's been a lot of rumors with this trailer and this show about who is gonna are we gonna have cameos in it. Uh, the one I've seen thrown around is that uh, Howard the Duck is gonna show up because yeah. he has been a frequent uh, team up member uh, with Jen in the comics. Well, then sooner or later they're gonna be doing a TV show with him, whether it's animated or not. I want a new duck. <laughs> we all do. I want, I, want, I want that duck, um, man. Give me the duck. It's really frustrating how much they tease that Howard's going to be Howard like... Howard the duck is a thing. A, a thing. But they, they, don't they don't do, do anything. anything with... And I'm like, guys, just give him to me. Like, the most they've I'm done... Ready, I'm ready for the duck. The most they've done was ha have, like, Howard being, like, a major factor in one of the episodes of What If, <clears throat> where he marries Darcy. Oh, it's Mrs. the Duck. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, it's just Duck. The is his middle name. His name is Howard T. Duck. <laughs> But, um... No, I... I know some... Howard's one of those characters, take him or leave him. I really fucking like Howard. It's just amusing to me. Um... It, it, it's like a shit post come to life. Yeah. And so... That's mostly what we got. Um, the trailer implies a few things, like... <clears throat> that Jennifer has been She-Hulk at least for a, for a while. Yeah. Um... And that Bruce has been training her into how to... Control the control the beast within especially because this is science hulk as we're, we've seen him um it's professor hulk professor hulk yeah and basically she eventually like you know develops into the hulk, the she hulk we know her as where she's always the she she hulk basically um and basically from what i like gather from this the most well, yes and no um there there have been periods where jen can turn back into normal. Well, yeah. No, I, I know that I, there have. From from some of the scenes in the trailer, I think they are going to go with that. Mm. Um, because, there, like I said, there are certain scenes in this trailer where that does seem to be what's going on. But and then, but there's other scenes where it doesn't seem to be the case. So I wonder if maybe she, start, yeah, starts, she starts out with her having unable, that yeah, and then it, to... it, it goes away. I'm not yeah. sure. I'm sure they'll... I'm sure it'll be explained yeah. over the course of the show. Plus, I, I... This also got... This also has nine episodes. Oh, okay. instead of six. That's good. But they're only 30 minutes. I mean, because they're, they're, they're doing it like it's a sitcom. Yeah. You know, and sitcom is, you know, obviously top, typical 30 minutes. But. Yeah. Um, we did see some uh, some big teases, though. Like, for one, we saw Abomination in the tra in the trailer, so... Titania is in there. I, was she in there? I didn't see her. Yeah. I, to be fair, I don't I don't exactly... Again, Frogman. <laughs> the less said about him, the better. I'm excited for Frogman. I know you're excited for Frogman. I know Frogman. there's going to be plenty of shit posts. <laughs> I'm ready. But... Um, but yeah, like, I, like, and not only that, she wears the, uh, the costume she wore when she was a member of the, Inve the Avengers as well. Um, which I'm really hoping that I'm like, if they're willing to do that, if, if they ever have her crossover with Fantastic Four, which I think they are going to do eventually. Yeah. 
give Jen the FF uniform she That'd has nice. in the comics. That would like, be nice. I would love that. Um, but yeah, like otherwise, it the trailer more or less kind of just gives you an idea of what the show's about. Particularly like the fact that she's she's single and thirty. It's hard for her to date, and she uh, eventually picks up this dude who's I guess really into her being just ginormous and picking her up picking him up and taking her to, him to bed which I'm like and then immediately afterward everybody on the internet was like god I wish that were me yeah <laughs> I'm like the horny posting got way 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 oh, out the, of especially that control. that one shot of her leaping through the air that like it looks like she's gonna step on you and directed I'm like, by Quentin Tarantino <laughs> <laughs> well no like everyone and their mother and I'm like guys holy shit I mean, they had a line in the trailer that your, your ass is crazy right now. Oh, and yeah. Like, like, God damn, they are playing this. Well, like that, they drew it <laughs> like is, they, This is what I wanted, yeah. obviously, because this is this is the kind of shit that does happen in a She-Hulk yeah. comic. But my God, man, they dove all in. They went in the deep end of the pool. I what? love it. Like, they drew they drew her ass, like, well, I shouldn't say drew. They animated her ass, like, it, like, literally as thick as that one Secret Wars one where, like, literally her ass is, like, the size of a bowling ball. <clears throat> well, two bowling balls. The, the biggest thing for me, um, as somebody who um, loved the, the John Barn run on She-Hulk, which yeah. if you haven't read that, find a way to get that. Um, I know it's in omnibus form now. It's a little expensive. I think the trades are out of print at the moment. Yeah. But with the show coming up, I, I wouldn't be surprised if Marvel throws that shit back in print immediately. Yeah. Well, and to be fair, that that's more or less what this, I'm is assuming based this on. is based on is the but burn I'm, run. I'm getting there. There was confirmation from somebody months ago um, that actually worked with Marvel. It wasn't a rumor. This was actual genuine confirmation. Yeah. She will break the fourth wall during the show <laughs> and talk directly to Kevin Feige. Yeah. I am going to fucking lose it because, A, for those who don't know, Jen did that before Deadpool. That is a Jen, that is a Jen characteristic. I will fight and I will die on a hill. I don't care. I mean, to be fair, Spider-Man did that before her, too. Yeah, but... <laughs> but it's just going to be fucking hilarious. No, if they're willing it, to it do that, be. I'm like... What other crazy shit from the comics are we going to get? Are we going to get Dr. Bong? God, if they did fucking they, Dr. They, if Bong. If Dr. Bong shows up and we're watching it, pause, I got to go outside. Yeah, no. <laughs> the only way that's acceptable is if, like, at the end of it, at the end of the show, Doom, Doom fucking murders, murders him. him. Is like, how dare you? <laughs> There's only one doctor and it is Doom. I, ch I mean, that would be amazing too, but... But yeah, like, there's a lot of... I, if the rumor that they're they're thinking about bringing Howard into this, yeah, is true, I I want to know what other crazy ass shit from the from that run are we gonna get pulled in? Yeah, well, I'm also excited for the fact that apparently they want to tease like I think that whatever Daredevil thing they're doing in this show, like I think they like we're not gonna just get Charlie, like he's also gonna show up as Daredevil, which makes me a little excited because like I can't wait because they're like oh he's gonna have the yellow and black yeah costume. he's gonna have the, he's gonna have the, the OG old, costume yeah the original yellow and black costume I'm like oh please I want that so bad because I, I like fuck that black leotard shit he had during the show fuck that shit give really? me the actual costume the problem with that was it was fine for one season and then they had an actual costume <laughs> that that's from when we actually that's another rant show. that's another I, rant for that but anyway um. Like I said, I'm very, I'm really, really excited for this. No, honestly, because I, I, I really too. like Jen as a character, especially yeah. after like the the barn run. The barn run really cemented it for me because I was like, mm -hmm. this this was great. It was it was funny. It it had action. You know, it had a little bit of everything, which I liked, and it did it yep. so well in a way that felt like really, really fresh compared to a lot of other comics. Yeah, it, it it was it was a a run that like it knew it was a comic. But it was gonna kick the borders out basically, yeah. and just be like, we can do whatever the fuck we want. It, like, it's a lot of the same tone that like Howard the Duck comics have, where yeah. it's very tongue in cheek. Mm -hmm. I'm really hoping they translate a lot of that to the <coughs> show, especially because I think especially a big sign for me with that is that it, they went with a sitcom type format, which we haven't really yeah. seen them do. They hinted at it with Wandavision, where we had homages to other shows that yeah. were sitcoms. But this is like supposed to be like a genuine sitcom, mm -hmm. so I'm really hoping they embrace just like the tongue in cheek and the humor and stuff. You know, like yeah. let it be, let it be funny. Yeah, I'm also kind of curious what like because like I one of the things I am excited for, considering they're going to be bringing up the whole superhero judicial system, I'm curious to see like what how exactly that's going to plan out. Like maybe we're actually going to see the Sokovia Accords finally get abolished because of how fucking stupid they are. Um, and just, like, I'm, I, 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 because I'm, I want to see, like, what her, 
the what you know what's going to that entail? Since she, you know one of the big things that makes Jennifer so interesting is that she is a lawyer. You know, like it, it's much in the same way that Matt is a lawyer, although like she's more often a prosecutor than a defense attorney. But um, yeah, I, I am curious to see that, and like I like I said, I always enjoyed the fact that She Hulk kind of plays this line about she wants to be a superhero, but at the same time she also is trying to balance it with being a, a lawyer and single and just that sort of thing. Like, because I'm, I'm mostly happy for the fact real, that... Real world problems. Yeah, I'm mostly happy for the fact they didn't... They didn't do what I was afraid they were going to do and do the Savage She-Hulk run where she's just a mindless beast like the Hulk is a lot of the time. Yeah, same here. I'm glad they didn't go with that, especially because, like, in the comics, they actually just recently... Fixed, fixed her. Fixed that. Yeah. Which, if you guys haven't read that issue or seen clips of it, please look it up. It's fucking hilarious. It's like they're in, they're in her head. Yeah. And, like... She's put Savage She-Hulk on trial. Yeah. And the fucking jury is made up of other She-Hulks, She-Hulks but they're yeah. all dressed up like different versions. Like, one yeah. of them looks like Thor. It, it's absolutely hysterical. Yeah. Like, at one point, like, you know, Savage She-Hulk flips out and, like, busts up the bench. Yeah. And so Jen is just like, permission to treat the, tr- <laughs> to treat the, uh, the witness as hostile. And I'm like... <laughs> permission granted. <laughs> no, I, like, because, like, like, I... I'm asking the jury... To, yeah. to, to rule and erase her from existence, or better yet, I'll do it myself. myself. <laughs> and I'm like, Jesus. Well, then I, I, it, I don't, it's fantastic. Like, I, I get why they did it because, like, it was just after Bruce had died, and it, it kind of was like she'd be like her rage at like the fact that the hero community killed Bruce caused her to become unstable. Yeah. At the same time, I'm like, it got old very quickly. Well, then it was one of those things where like it was like well, we're gonna finally fix her because she shouldn't just be. Curvy, she should be like muscular, like with actual muscle. Because Stanley, don't make me come down there, you punk. Well, to be fair, I'm like, you know, like she's a Hulk. It doesn't matter what her body shape is. She's gamma radiated. Yeah. Like then, like I, uh, like there's a lot of reasons why I got annoyed with that. Like yeah. I'm just like I like Jen being part of that Fantastic Four. <laughs> well, then I, I, I well, then, like making her a like a big beefy Hulk monster. Kind of ruins like the the uniqueness that was her. Yeah. Like I and I know, well, she's just a derivative of Hulk. I'm like, so is Batgirl and Supergirl, <laughs> and you all don't complain about that. Well, some of you don't, but I. But like one of the things that made she You're Hulk right, so f- Adam neckbeards who don't actually read comics do. They? Yeah. Uh, but they don't want to read. They just want to be mad. <laughs> well, yeah. I, but like my 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 point was more like I I like that she like Jen was a, was actually able to conquer her monster it made her interesting because the monster isn't her problem the problem is dudes all dudes that don't she don't want to ogle her ogle her so she just beats the shit out of them with her super strength like that one time she was tanning up on top of the back oh and, and those somebody, guys somebody, were, somebody took pictures of it and she was like i'm gonna fucking murder somebody <laughs> but um overall i i am excited for this um oh if i were to only say one thing i i don't know you but like i did not i it's going to be weird adjusting to, like, her face with the CG. Well, and I, there were a lot of complaints I saw on the internet with the CG. The, yeah. um, I'm, I'm, I'm reserving my judgment until I actually see the show because I'm convinced that it, it, it's not done yet. Yeah. Because there was stuff in, like, the other, like, the No Way Home trailer or yeah. the Mom trailer where it's, like, you could tell stuff wasn't finished. I think that's normal at this point, especially... Yeah. We're just slowly coming out of a, of a COVID type world. We're still kind of in it. Yeah. So like, I'm I'm willing to kind of suspend my judgment until I actually see it. Especially because like for me, I'm just like, does it does it look good? Okay. I don't really give a shit. Yeah. I'm not one of these people that are like borderline psychotic about it. Doesn't look like Avatar level shit. And I'm like, who fucking cares? Yeah. Well- my my problem, like, like, yeah, like, my, it shouldn't be it shouldn't be that big a deal. My problem with the face thing is more just like, for me, like CGI realistic looking faces never really look like they look off to me. Like not like in like a like. No, I, I think get it. For me, I'm it's just, an uncanny valley sort of thing. For me, it's like it's never really bothered me. But again, I I get where it bothers some people. I just I just I'm thankful I just don't have that problem. No, it, like, like I said, because like I said, the the rest of the CGI was fine. It, it again, it, it's more for me. CGI faces are it's hard like. Especially when they're realistic looking, like like Groot or Rocket, don't bother me. But it's when it's, you're trying to put a CGI human face, it, like well, like Thanos. Yeah, well, Thanos at least has the butt chin, so like I can like he he has enough cartoonish features that it like it's more like when Bruce is, like like is talking as like Professor Hulk. I'm like, 
that looks really weird because <laughs> it like and I don't know why I, I think it's just an uncanny valley sort of thing yeah I mean it's just like I said I'm just thankful but, I don't have that yeah like if I once I watch it enough I'll be like eh, it doesn't bother yeah. me <laughs> it's, it's one of those things where like when you first see it I'm like oh that that's not real <laughs> I don't know about that chief yeah so well the rest of her was fine if I if I may like I enjoyed looking at her ass if that's what you're asking <laughs> Adam I think half the internet enjoyed no, I did Listen, I just want to be picked up and carried. That's all I want. We all do. Um, somebody, somebody was like, "This is this is the year of the mommy verse or some shit." <laughs> oh yeah, because like, one Christ. Yeah. I'm like, holy fuck, man! The internet needs to calm down. Don't worry. They, they once they release enough of those like weird faces that that Elizabeth Olsen makes in like in between shots of things, <laughs> it'll stop. Because in in you know. And mom, she didn't like make like the orgasm faces like she did in the one episode of WandaVision. <laughs> I don't want to talk about this anyway, guys. But anyway, I think that's gonna wrap this up. Uh, this was just our first reactions. Like I said, I'm really excited for the show. It drops in August, I believe, on the 17th on yep. Disney Plus. And again, I think we're in for something good. Yeah, I, I agree. Um, Especially if I get my duck. Uh, yeah, uh, look forward. Uh, we're gonna be shooting the Moon Knight one directly after this. So that you can tell because we're in the same clothes. Let's and switch places. Maybe they won't think that. <laughs> Maybe they won't think that it's the same fucking night. Uh, Quickly they don't change care. the background a little bit. They don't care. We'll do it. We'll do a day for night shot and just say it was the same night. <laughs> but and then you're gonna be like, you're gonna talk about like grilling my ass charcoal black like we're fucking samurai cop. <laughs> but. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I'm Average Joe Squad. And I'm Songetsu134. And as always, we ask you, remember the hyphen? And take care.